CataractCoach.com, Cataract Quiz, should you yag this? So look, the eyewall optic is fine, but behind it, you see all this opacity. Here's the patient with this little lamp. Cataract surgery was done, let's say, a year or two or three ago. And you can see there's a lot of posterior capsule opacification. So looking back there, it's really blocking the vision. So do you do a YAG laser capsulotomy here? And then what happens to all that material? Does that float around then in the vitreous? Think about that. What should we do here? Well, our guest surgeon says, no, let's go back to the operating room. So in the operating room, try to see, can you wash away some of this material here? So making a couple pairs of TCs. Let's see, lift up the lens. I like this idea. Try to carefully dissect the lens from the capsule bag. Can you go behind there and aspirate out that material? What would you do here? So again, slowly dissecting away the IOL from the capsule or bag. And actually, if you needed to, you could do an IOL exchange. But let's just say you don't need a, a lens exchange. The lens is the appropriate power. It looks clear. There's no um, opacification of the optic. That's not an issue here. So again, trying to loosen it up a little bit. You see a little bit of that lens material that's f behind the optic kind of leaking forwards in front of it now. Hmm, interesting here. So we're by manual IA, that's a good idea. Can you lift this up and go behind there and vacuum underneath there? So again, very careful, try to lift that up. There we go, now you've lifted the lens. And can you go behind it now? Hold the lens up a little bit, the optic, go behind there. Can you just aspirate all that material? Hmm, it's kind of tough. So here's now some viscoelastic to separate the capsule bag, open it up a little bit. Maybe, why don't we lift the lens up a little bit more? So very interesting case here. It looks like proliferation of a lot of these lens epithelial cells, a lot of proliferation. Here, getting the IOL carefully up out of the capsule bag. Give yourself some room there. I don't know if you need to remove, uh, lift up both haptics, but there's one haptic up. Here's the other one. Okay, maybe lifting it up again. So now you've got the entire IOL sitting on top of the ash. Now you've got some room there behind there to maneuver. Can you aspirate that and clean the bag? So here's more viscoelastic. But what about another technique? How about a power wash? Injecting BSS, just BSS, and power wash on the capsule. And look at this. You can get almost all of this lens material, these lens epithelial cells, aspirated and loosened up pretty easily. Now go behind there with the IA Pro by manual set up here, and then aspirate, aspirate, aspirate. And look, you can really clean up that capsular bag here. So very interesting approach here. And the patient obviously is going to be very happy. You're cleaning up all that lens material. Now, could it come back in the future? Sure, it could. But again, this kind of thorough cleanup is very helpful. And again, looks, looks like, uh, yeah, don't grab the capsule there. Very nice cleanup. There you go. So getting all that lens material out, look how clean the capsule bag is now. Pow! So there's really no fibrosis of the capsule bag. Now putting the eyewall back in the bag. Nicely done under the guidance of viscoelastic there, under the protection of viscoelastic, and getting the haptics in good position. Wow, what a beautiful outcome here. Again, the capsule bag didn't fibrose much. You just had a lot of prolifer proliferation of those lens epithelial cells, causing a lot of opacity. If you had done a YAG laser, gosh, all that stuff would be floating in the vitreous cavity, probably even induce some inflammation. The patient would have to be on some topical steroids for quite a while. Interesting approach here. Look at the outcome. Really nice, beautifully done. This is the post-op pick. Fantastic. If you want to submit a video, hey, go to cataractcoach.com, the website, and there's a link that tells you how you can submit your own video, and we'll feature it here and make you a superstar.